Renewable energy is becoming the main energy source and playing an increasingly important role of helping establish a new power system. Energy storage will be a critical component in this system to track the uncontrollability, inconsistence, and uncertainty of traditional renewable energy system. Hello everyone, I'm Liu Xuan. Today, we are bringing you here to our first energy storage pilot project in Jinan, Shandong province. Please follow me. I will show you the whole project and explain our leading digital and power electronic technologies. The objective of this project for the user with regards to energy storage is to help adjust the peak value power consumption, which means the energy is charged at night and is discharged during peak period and peak hours during the day to supply power for the campaigns. The average power of the campaigns is about 30 kW and the peak power is 50 kW. It is expected to guarantee for about 10 hours of power supply from the storage per day. Moving forward with me, let's have a quick look at the equipment applied in this project. Luna 2000 2.0 MWh 2H0 Smart Street ESS Smart ECU 2000D Luna 2200 KTL H0 PCS and DC books Auxiliary transformer and main transformer in this ESS, here is a door-mounted air conditioner and six of it are installed in one container. Here are the battery packs. 16 320 amp hour cells in each battery pack with internal battery pack optimizer. The 21 battery packs are connected in series and the rig, and six battery rigs are connected in parallel. This top right corner is equipped with smart rig controller and each battery rig connects to one DC and DC module. Right down here is DC books and fire extinguishing system. We will show you how those technologies are applied in the system and achieve unique values for the project later. In the traditional energy storage system, one central PCS manages more than 2,000 battery cells. As these cells are parallel and several connected, the internal differences will cause several mismatch. Centralized cooling system worsens the mismatch due to the uneven working temperature, leading to reduced usable capacity quick battery degradation, higher O&M cost, and loaner safety. In Huawei Smart Street ESS, we use innovative technologies such as pack and rig level optimization, distributed cooling, and module PCS to achieve higher discharge capacity. The optimizers in parallel with battery packs ensure that every pack can be fully discharged and charged. When a battery pack reaches a full charge or discharge state, the optimizer in the pack starts to bypass the battery pack, so that other battery packs can continue charging and discharging, and every pack can be fully utilized regardless of cell differences. Our intelligent rig level management allows the rigs to run independently, eliminating the mismatch between parallel rigs maximizing the potential of each battery rig and increasing the discharge capacity throughout the life circle by 15%. What are the other technologies that we have brought more energy for this project? Moving here are the distributed air conditioners, which could individually cool each rig 
and together with mixed air tuna inside the pack. So that the temperature differences in the container less than 3 degrees Celsius. Thus, the battery lifetime could be extended by 50%. Safety and reliability are always the first to be considered for the large-scale storage energy system. Considering of this, we have developed four levels of safety assurance design to ensure the safe operation of the plant. Firstly is a smart internal short circuit diagnosis based on AI analysis of circling curve buses. Smart internal short circuit diagnosis could identify hidden short circuit tendencies and predict fire hazard. Secondly, is a battery pack self production. The battery pack optimizer isolates the battery pack and could turn off the switch immediately. Thirdly, the battery rig could shut down the system actively to prevent failed spread. And these two circuit breakers and fuses could isolate two level faults to make sure multiple intelligent productions. The last one is system level production. As you could see here, when the internal gas is emitted due to the overheating or damage of the battery pack, the smoke sensor inside the container starts to exhaust the gas to the outside based on the concentration of the dangerous gas to reduce the concentration. Besides, this equipment also could release inside gas to reduce the concentration inside to prevent fire and explosion. The simple NM is another value we have added. With pack level optimization, every pack is automatically calibrated. No need of system shutdown. And when failed authors, plug and play design keeps the system free from expensive on site diagnosis with experts. Thus, this simple OM could reduce around 2 million RMB cost per year for a 200 megawatt hour project, and no annual equalized charging maintenance is required. It nearly comes to the end of today's online tour. Thanks so much for your time. And we all wish to see you in person to discuss more of this project in the very near future. We strongly believe that the integration of digital technologies will unleash the potential of energy storage and drive the industry towards carbon neutrality goals. Thanks again and goodbye.